Hello everybody! Um, update, if any of you were hating on my flashlight um, idea, it worked! Um, the first night, Posey got up at 4.30, yes, still not great, but better than one. And last night, she got up at five. So the flashlight, no TV, like quiet upstairs completely. Uh, the big kids going down later than the little ones. It's working, cross your fingers, it keeps working. We're only on day two, so, but it's working. I feel really, um, excited about it because we're getting sleep and I feel like a person again. <laughs> uh, second, we accepted the offer of the guy who put in the offer and but we are doing another showing today because the person um, wants to see the house that was already on the books after we accepted the offer. It's like a backup. So we are doing that today. Um, all four have school and so I gotta get the house set up for the showing and then take the girls out. We're gonna go to Target and look for new pajamas for Griffin because I had to cut the sleeves off because he kept chewing on them and I cut the feet off because we had to turn them backwards. So some of you sent me a link to special needs pajamas on Amazon. We're not gonna be here in time when they would get delivered so we have to wait until we get to Colorado to order them. So we have to maintain something until we get there. You were just a master. Get her out of your clothes. A master. It's been a little bit crazy of a morning. I haven't got my face on yet. The boys leave in 10 minutes to go on the bus. The little ones, Sawyer and Griffin. Um, we had two accidents this morning. Wynn, who held it too long, did make it to the toilet and she was like next to the toilet. And then Posey, when we were, she was upstairs, we were cleaning up. Wynn, we didn't hear Posey in the potty downstairs going potty potty, she had an accident. And we're just stressed out. So yeah, we have Will's coffee right now for the road. And if you watch our live stream, this is the night after Will work till over past eight o'clock. So we're both just exhausted and we're tired. So, <laughs> but it's okay. As soon as the kids get to, off to school, the house will calm down. So just gotta get there. Okay, so Griffin and Sawyer left. I got my face on, got the house pretty much set up for the showing. The show isn't there for a few hours, but I thought instead of trying to keep the house alive and not disgusting, uh, even with two, I said, so we're just gonna go out, we're gonna go to Target, look for Griffin's pajamas. Um, Posey needs a couple new t-shirts. Um, she's just, she got really like dirty and I can't get the stains out. So I'm gonna buy some cheap shirts at Target, nothing crazy. And uh, yeah, we'll do that. But we're just waiting for the bus. House is set, kids are in the car, flash showing. Hallelujah. This is just for backup, like I said, and we'll see what happens. We are here at Target. Mama. Are you ready to go get some stuff? Mama. What? It's Target. It's Target, you're right. Yep. Lindy took her shoes off. Did white. you take her shoes off? I'm too white. No. Oh, someone's tired. <laughs> I'm too white. We can look at the toy. Maybe we'll get you a, a, a coloring book or something. And we'll see. <laughs> we went through the jammy section already. They only have fleece, which it'll work for the time being. I'll cut the arms off. It shouldn't fray and the feet off, but this will work for now because the other ones are falling apart. So yay. Um, and I got this a Batman version too. I'm going to try. And I got that for Posey. She needs some shirts. Hey, 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 hey. What are we hooting at? What are we hooting at? You don't want to look at your book anymore? No? No. All right, we're gonna go to the toy section now. Help me, I won't get anything big. <laughs> All right, we're in the girl aisle. And like, let me tell you, I would have died for that as a little girl. I would have begged my mom so bad for something like that. <laughs> you guys are a little young for LOL dolls. Okay, be a little older. Oh, Lindy. Oh, 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 oh. Get over here. <laughs> so, Posey had a little meltdown about toys. I got coloring books. Oh, got this one, the Vamp Arena. The color on the way home. She's so grumpy, guys. Oh, three is hard. <sighs> threes are hard. And it's gonna be hard right when she's heading out of threes. Um, Lindy will be heading into hers. So, I, we gotta. Gotta hang in there. She's very pouty. Um, so it was a little chaotic in there. Someone was telling me that. Sorry, I'm talking. I'm making it right now. Please, 
please. So I'm gonna up the Target app to get. I guess it's a great discount. And so now we're gonna be living by a Target. I only come here like once every two months, if I'm lucky. If I'm lucky. Um, that there's some great deals. So I'm gonna be getting me some Target app soon. We're excited. Here you go. So the showing is in less than an hour. We're about an hour away from home. So I'm going to head home now. And yeah, keep going. So I stopped by Will's work. Hi. Which is the streets. The streets. <laughs> it sounds funny when I, I say Belong to the streets. Belong to the streets. To give a drink. And because the show is almost over and then we'll head home. But the girls are struggling today. We've got some real struggles. What's the matter? Why are you sad? Because they're tired. You want the, you want the bunny? Are you all done french fries? They're really mad they didn't get a toy. Let me throw at it away. The store. Both of them. You want to hold on to it? Really mad. You bought tablets too. And what'd you get for me? I got you some clothes for Posey. Cause she, I was looking at her shirt and like a bunch clothes of them stains on them. And I'm like, I can't get wow. them out. So I got some really, New pants. a couple pairs, wow. nothing, nothing crazy. No, pants. I wanted to buy like everything, but I couldn't. Moo pants? Like a cow yeah, pants? Yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> Moo. Moo pants. <laughs> No Kit Kat pants? <laughs> Doggy pants? Ooh, ooh. <laughs> Birdie pants? Tweet, 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 tweet. <laughs> I don't know why it's so funny. There are no other animal sounds. Fox pants? <laughs> ding, 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 ding. <laughs> what do you mean? What about the, the, the sheep pants? I'm joking. No other animal. Oh, I thought maybe you were like forgetting. <laughs> the duck pants? <laughs> Posy pants? <laughs> okay, we just got home. I guess the showing went well. I don't even know if anyone showed up, but you never know. You never can tell, really. Uh, Posy fell asleep. She, I'll let her sleep for a little bit. She's so cranky. Yeah, she's asleep. My poor baby. Her, we have her a little tablet time. We've been in the car a long time. It's just crazy. Like, we we sold the house pretty much, and this we just did the showing, like I said earlier. It's a backup. I don't think it's gonna fall through, um, but you just never know. I kind of didn't want to like test fate, if you know what I mean. Uh, so yeah, so Sawyer and Griffin will get home in about an hour and a half, and after that, Harrison win, and hopefully Will gets off on time. He thinks he will, so we're just gonna keep chugging along with this day, and yeah. In a couple weeks, we are moving. I can't believe it. I'm so excited. I know I should have probably recorded this, but I totally was just like calling to see what was gonna happen. But like, I got more good news. Not about the house. I don't, I don't, I don't think anybody even showed up, but you never know. Um, I don't think we'll hear anything unless we lose the offer, the first offer. But I called about Griffin and Sawyer's preschool and it seems like they're gonna get in, and it seems like it's gonna be mid-December, just like the big kids, we have to apply. We got a phone number to talk to the person who will be like managing their special needs stuff, and um, I know it's only half day, but that's fine because it's just fine. They need school, I've seen them grow so much. Sawyer loves school. Uh, Griffin, I think, really likes it too, uh, from what I can tell, but it was just, everyone was so nice. This lady was like, I just moved here a year ago, Colorado Springs is the best place on the planet. You will are gonna be so happy. I'm like, like thank you. Like I'm so excited. <laughs> like and everyone has been so helpful and so nice, and they make it seem easy. Like, like I, let me tell you, special needs stuff has not been easy. It's been hard. It's been fighting with insurance and not getting teachers and yelling at school districts. This, I mean, I'm not saying it's gonna last forever, but. Like they're like, oh, they're disabled? Okay, well we have a program for this and they maybe maybe they get to be in the same class together and we have therapists and I was like, it just, it was weird. Sorry, someone just texted me. Oh, pictures of Sawyer at school. Hold on, let me I can show you guys. Okay, this is from his, the school he's at now, Sawyer. I haven't got to see any pictures. Oh, he's wearing flippers to help uh, with his toe walking, Sawyer. <laughs> Okay, can you see? Look how cute he is! There's another one. Look at, she said it helps so much with his toe walking. And with his, he we have a prescription for his um, 
AFO's ankle braces, but they had to cancel because a family member who was died and they only have one orthotic person. Um, so, oh, here's another picture. Uh, he's just standing there. And they didn't have anybody else to like cover the shift. He has an appointment tomorrow, but if they can't ship the orthotics to Colorado Springs, we're just gonna pass. I have to, I have to call them in a few minutes. And, sorry, I'm crazy. Um, I have to go wake up Posey in a few minutes. I'm gonna have to go pick up Harrison and Wynn's immune records so we can submit that all online for their school. But I'm just saying, like, everyone's been so helpful. It's been so amazing. Like, all I've known is struggle and, and fighting and, or, and people like when you say disability, they, they're like, what? Like, I would, like they, they give me more of like a, here, like, they don't know how to deal with it. But even like, I don't know, it's just about how I feel. I could be wrong. Um, it just feels like it's been more of a struggle if your child is d disabled here. Um, that there's just not enough programs, there's not enough people to help the people that are disabled here. And that's, it's, it's no one's fault, it's just what it is. Um, it's the state's fault. <laughs> I just, I, again, like, I don't know how to deal with this joy, guys. Like, I, I feel, like, unworthy. Like, it's been so hard. And, like, for years it's been hard. And it's so awesome. Like, I can't, I'm just so happy. And I just, it, it feels wrong. Like, I'm not used to it. And it feel, I feel like manic. It's, um, it's just so nice, like I can't. And I know it's not always gonna be easy. Like Posey was having a meltdown in the car and I wanted to pull my hair out. And I know that was hard, but then I kept going, we have an offer on the house. We have a beautiful house we're gonna be moving into that's gonna fit everyone. Like Will's parents are coming. The babies, Jenna, our babysitter is helping us drive across the country. Like, like, it's just such good news. So I gotta, I gotta eat something really quick. I have not had lunch. And then I gotta go run and get the um, immunization records for the new school for the two. Griffin and Sawyer have a doctor's appointment next week uh, for their new immune, like new shots and stuff they have to get. So I can't get theirs yet until next week. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah. Okay, we're here at the doctor's office going to get the paperwork um, for the big kids. Okay. All right, we just went in and we got their records. So, heading home, the boys are home like in 20 minutes, so I have to fly. I know, we don't, I thought maybe we'd have time to go to Walmart, but we don't have time. I'm sorry, baby. Well, next time. All right, we're home. We decided to play outside for a little bit until the boys get home. Mommy. She's going down the slide. Here she goes. Lindy, your turn. Posey, woo! Nice job. All right, here comes Lindy. Her turn to go down the slide. Oh, okay, you gotta sit right. You gotta sit right. And go. Mark it set, go! Woo! Posey's turn. Mark it set, go! Get some bread pies! We're not getting French fries today. How was school? No. I saw you in your flippers. You want to show you? Can I show you a picture, really quick? Whoa. Ready? Can I show you? Look at. Can I show you something? Oh um, no! Look at. Look at. Look at. Is that you? Is that you? Look at. Is that you? In school today? You wearing flippers on your feet? <laughs> Lindy's right under me. Hi, Griffin. Are you okay? Ah. <sighs> They were both sleeping in the bus and they're tired. <sighs> it's hard, they don't ever tell me anything and they come in like a, um, they come in just ready. <laughs> it was such a crazy day. The days are gonna be just like this for however long, I don't know. I love being busy anyway. That's why we. That's why I wanted a lot of kids. Yes, they trust me out. I, I cry a lot because they're safe. They get my heart strings, you know what I mean? Mom, Gil, all the above. I just don't like not having anything to do. So, yeah, that's why I really wanted a big family. Um, and I do, I love being busy. Uh, but yeah, I don't even know why I told you guys that. I just wanted to tell you. <laughs> I'm just happy. It's so cool. 
Uh, yes, yeah, so I think we're gonna end the vlog here. I think a lot's happened today. I think the rest of this. One second. Okay, Will just called. He got bit by a dog. He said he doesn't need stitches, but he had to call his supervisor. I don't think he has to go to the hospital, but he got bit by a dog. Oh my god. All right. I feel sick. I'll let you know what happened. Are you bandaged up? What? Are you bandaged up? I have a band-aid on. Okay. Does it hurt to walk? Um, just, just stings a little bit. Turn. I can't even see it. It's up here. Oh, it's a big band-aid. Band Man, he went up under your, under your leg, like. Yeah, well, look. Did it go through your pants? So he went through there. I mean, it must, so how big are the puncture wounds? Like, like the size of a pea? They're not that big. Okay. So what happened? Tell our friends. I had just delivered the mail and I was walking away from the house and the person at the house opened the door and the dog shot out and I didn't even hear the dog coming. Cause there was the other dog was barking at the window, Ugh. so I, all I felt was the dog bite me. It like bit me and then just like went back, like so it didn't like stay on my my leg. But, Thank goodness! Oh my gosh! Yeah, it just shocked me, surprised me. But yeah, and you're gonna find out the medical records probably tomorrow or the next day. Yeah. So it seems good. They seem like a good like a house that would they take care of their dogs. Dogs and stuff, so. Okay. Did it seem rabious? <laughs> I don't know. I, I really didn't even see the dog. That's insane. It bit me and then went right. Back it was like to the house. it was like bite and then was like I can't do this. <laughs> I can't do this. Taste what of, am I doing? What am I doing? <laughs> I'm so sorry. I can't stop myself. Oh, yeah, it was just... oh, so scary. I'm so. I mean, I'm so grateful it was like happening. Like it happened like that and not like what we've heard of awful people have dealt with some serious awful bites before. Yeah. All right, guys. I'm gonna end this vlog here. Will is okay, but crazy life of being a mailman, right? Thank you guys for watching. Please check out our merch below. This one is one of them. Hello, everybody, and all of the Team Griffin shirts. Five dollars every shirt will go to the Angelman Syndrome Foundation, and the rest will go to our move to Colorado Springs in a few weeks. Um, yeah. So we'll see you next time. Follow me on my social media, and don't forget, guys, you are wonderful. Bye. Bye.